Kepha Rishon, 1 Peter 1. Kepha, an apostle of Yahusha, Hamashiach, to the strangers scattered throughout Pontus, Galatia, Cappadocia, Asia, and Bithynia, elect according to the foreknowledge of Yahuwah, the Father, through sanctification of the Ruach, unto obedience and sprinkling of the blood of Yahusha, Hamashiach, grace unto you and peace be multiplied. Blessed be Yahuwah and the Father of our Adonai Yahusha Hamashiach, which, according to his abundant mercy, has begotten us anew unto a lively hope by the resurrection of Yahusha Hamashiach from the dead, to an inheritance un, rather incorruptible and undefiled, and that fades not away, reserved in heaven for you, who are kept by the power of Yahuwah through belief unto salvation, ready to be revealed in the last time. Wherein ye greatly rejoice, though now for a season, if need be, ye are in heaviness through manifold temptations, that the trial of your belief, being much more precious than of gold that perishes, though it be tried with fire, might be found unto praise and honor and glory at the appearing of Yahusha HaMashiach, whom having not seen, ye love, in whom, though now ye see him not, yet believing, ye rejoice with joy unspeakable and full of glory, reviving the end of your belief, rather, receiving the end of your belief, even the salvation of your souls, eth of which salvation the prophets have inquired and searched diligently, who prophesied of the grace that should come unto you, searching what or what manner of time the Ruach HaMashiach, which was in them, did signify, when it testified beforehand at the sufferings of HaMashiach and the glory that should follow, unto whom it was revealed that not unto themselves, but unto us, they did minister the things which are now reported unto you, by them that have preached the Besara unto you with the Ruach HaKadesh sent down from heaven, which things the angels desire to look into. Wherefore, gird up the loins of your mind, be sober, and hope to the end for the grace that is to be brought unto you at the revelation of Yahusha HaMashiach, as obedient children, not fashioning yourselves according to the former lusts in your ignorance, but as he which has called you is holy, so be ye holy in all manner of conversation. Because it is written, Be ye holy, for I am holy. And if ye call on the Father, who without respect of persons judges according to every man's work, pass the time of your sojourning here in fear. For as much as ye know that ye were not redeemed with corruptible things, as silver and gold, from your vain conversation received by tradition from your fathers, but with the precious blood of Hamashiach, as of a lamb without blemish and without spot, who truly was foreordained before the foundation of the world, but was manifest in these last times for you, who by him do believe in Yahuwah, that raised him from up, rather up from the dead, and gave him glory, that your belief and hope might be in Yahuwah, seeing ye have purified your souls in obeying the truth through the Ruach unto unfeigned love of the brethren. See that ye love one another with a pure heart fervently.
being born from the beginning, not of corruptible seed, but of incorruptible, by the word of Yahuwah, which lives and abides forever. For all flesh is as grass, and all the glory of man as the flower of grass. The grass withers, and the flower thereof falls away. But the word of Yahuwah endures forever. And this is the word which by the Besara is preached unto you.